I thought my mind would never recover. One bad pill and I had enslaved myself in eternal darkness. My consciousness had escaped all reason, my ego dissolved into nihility, and I was alone, terrified of what lay beyond the surface. Eventually, I returned to reality, but my questions remained unanswered. My soul was changed, and my existence was reduced to mere images left on my living room table. Every day, I keep looking, searching for the part of me stuck there, in the dark. Pictures help me piece it all together, but I can't shake the feeling that the darkness is still there, watching me. My purpose in this life is to divulge into the unknown. I aim to seek out the cracks of instability, the lines of reason the points of observation, but that's all beyond me. If a man has his eyes bound, you can encourage him as much as you'd like to stare through the bandage, but he'll never see anything. People always ask me why I started taking pictures. I don't know the answer, but I'd like to think that photography found me. I see things in photos. Stories, illusions, answers. Each snap of a shutter captures a moment in time. Each photo carries a key to an alternate world, a gateway into the past. All of our movements, thoughts, jokes, terrors, all eternally solidified on chemically treated film stock. Once I see the resolution, everything will fit together. The pieces of the infinite puzzle have yet to be erased from the frames of my consciousness. I know the true answers of our world exist beneath the surface of this reality. That is where the darkness lives. Maybe today I'll capture it. Hello? Felix Stock? Yeah. I saw your photos in the exhibit of 13th. I have a proposal that... How did you get my number? Let's meet tomorrow. I will really have something that will... Stop serve. calling me. It's here. I know it.
Checkmate. One day, I'll beat you. I took these last week. These are stunning. They're so different. So much complexity. I'm getting closer to finding it. I can feel it. And when was the last time that you saw it? I see it every day now. Felix, you can't let this thing rule your life. Every week you come here saying that you're one step closer to finding the answers. One more photo away from exposure. But that never comes. Have you ever seen it, Charles? Felix, you must understand one thing about the demons of this world. They don't exist to give you the answers. They, they don't follow you for their own amusement. They're here to draw you in. They take your mind. They only appear to people who look for them. And when you find them, your perception of reality is lost in ways I can't convey. Stop looking. Felix, don't give in. All those things might kill you, right? You're Felix, aren't you? Who are you? I'm a huge fan of your work. You know, I take for... Look, man, I'm not interested. The darkness, Felix. I can see it too. It watches you. Whenever you piss in the morning, whenever you go out for a smoke, in fact, it is here right now. I don't know what you're talking about. I can see it in your photos, Felix. Normal minds can't perceive it. But you're special. We are special. This world is not meant to hold us. Let me help you. Why are you telling me this? It's just a matter of time, Felix. Take this. What is this? Find out for yourself.
Are you there? The complexities of your mind are too diverse for you to comprehend, Felix. Your notions of self-identity no longer exist. Your concept of individuality is scattered across infinite layers of time and space. Look within yourself, Felix. Look beyond everything you know. Search deep within your sentience and abandon your connection to reality. Only then you will find the answer. The answer was written right there, in the sky, waiting for me to capture it. But this time, I don't think I will. 